He's half man, half woman. It's Gary. I want to hip you to the T. It's Gary, baby. Oh. Gary had the tea and the color of the day, Gary. Good morning, Ricky. Good morning, America. Good morning to you. It's Friday, a beautiful, beautiful day in the neighborhood. And here's what's happening in celebrity news, y'all. Everybody's talking about it. I'm excited about it, y'all. Hopefully this is going to be true. But it's being reported, y'all, that Portia Williams, the beautiful Portia Williams from Real Housewives of Atlanta, they're saying, honey, her marriages, honey, are heating up. Now, we all know that Portia has filed for divorce from her wonderful husband, Mr. Simon Guabardia, y'all, recently. And people said, you know, that's a sad situation, but Portia still may come out smelling like a rose because it's being reported, y'all, that um, somebody spoke with a person that's close to the reality star who said, y'all, that Portia may be considering reconciling with her baby's father, Mr. Dennis McKinney, an Atlanta businessman. Now, they say you recall that Portia and Dennis, y'all, brought y'all daughter Pilar into this world together. Now, the couple split amicably and have remained in each other's lives, both as friends and co-parents. Well, they're saying, y'all, that Portia and Dennis were spotted, honey, recently, y'all, together at daughter Pilar's beautiful soccer match. Now, they're saying, y'all, that um, Portia has been um, leaning on Dennis, y'all, during this tough time that she's going through. And they're saying that Portia, honey, friends think that the two are rekindling their old love. Now, the friends mm-hmm. said that Dennis has always been around and that they never had issues between D and, to keep it real, they're saying he's probably the best relationship that she's ever had in whole, her whole entire life, honey. So, isn't that beautiful? You know, when you go back, how they say it, when y'all say it's spinning the block, honey? You know, if she's spinning the block because, you know, Dennis is her um, her daughter's father. Yeah. And, you know, I mean, you know, you know, sometimes, you know, people and They call not, that spinning the block. That They call it spinning the block because that's a new word. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I, I really think they just still good friends, Gary. Cause they is that co-parent. what it is? Yeah, they oh. co-parent and then people are just adding. Yeah, they that what it make is. make something up. Yeah. Uh, but you know what, too? It's like um, sometimes you can date a person and it's a certain version of that person. And after time and experience, you change, they change, and it's a better match when you get back together. Yeah. So that could be the case now. Well, congratulations. I mean, Ricky, could you go back to her ex uh, after absolutely. she had been with somebody, after she had been with somebody yeah, else? Yeah, I mean, sometimes, uh, yeah, I mean, you know, uh, people go through hell. I have been with somebody else probably and, and, and double that since they ex. But uh, yeah. sometimes you have to give them a chance, chance to grow. Uh, some In some cases, grow up. In some cases, mature. In yeah. some cases, you know, it just depends. Uh, yeah. You know, sometimes people are different and more mature, have more experience. And then when yeah. they come back, uh, you know, to the relationship, they're ready. Yeah. Well, if that's so, congratulations to them, y'all. Moving on, honey, and other celebrity news, y'all. They're saying, baby, the trend of washed-up bodies just landing wealthy young athletes. It's continuing, honey. It's being reported, y'all. We know we talked about Miss Dre and Michelle. You know, they said she got pregnant for her NBA star, Mr. Jalen Green. Well, honey, now it's being reported that... Her best friend, good friend, Miss Joey Chavez, honey, just did the same thing, honey. They're saying Joey is a 35-year-old. Yeah, they say, baby, Miss Joey, 35, a music video dancer who has children by Bow Wow and Future, honey, announced yesterday that she is pregnant and expecting her third child amid her romance with her boyfriend, guess who, Ricky? Trayvon Ooh. Diggs, y'all. Y'all know Trayvon? Oh, yeah. Yes, baby. Yes, they said this girl got her Trayvon Diggs. Now, they say uh, Miss Chavez and the Dallas Cowboys saw first spark dating rumors back in September 2022 when Mr. Diggs posted a video of the internet personality to his Instagram stories in honor of her birthday. Now, they're saying the she following month. Bad. She got two brothers yeah. and an NFL huh. player. Yeah. He, bought, he bought her a Rolls Royce Cullinan yeah. for her birthday. Yes, baby. He loved her. And the thing is, though, Rick, I mean, he's only making 90 seven million dollars he just signed a 97 million dollar contract extension oh. honey and they say it's worth up to 104 million dollars in potential bonuses so i mean you know he got some um, extra change that he could help her Roll out with damn tight. yeah he's from alabama today so he played in alabama <laughs> but now it's also report y'all that he has three kids honey from a previous relationship and miss chavez has her daughter shy which is 12 from bow wow and her son Hendricks, which is five from future, y'all. So congratulations. It's good that love is still finding itself. And what I like about this, though, these younger guys are loving these older women, honey, because they deserve love, too. So, you know, go ahead and give them who you need to give with and love them and, and you know, and take care of them. And, and it's just a good look. Woo. So. And, and it's black boy, love. I could That's imagine like. the dating pool back in, back in the 90s, boy. The dating pool was like that. Man, yeah. you had to go to the damn club to find somebody. Yeah. You had to have a pen and a little piece of paper. Right. Write that number Damn. down. 
Well, now you just got to put a picture on social media, honey. And the guys, and it's amazing. So these guys must be really yearning for these young ladies when they were younger. You know, just to pair posters of them on, you know. They might be, they the might be thinking that the older ladies are more mature. Or well, they are. Probably the chicks their age probably are uh, just not ready. But yeah. they're older, but they're not old. You know what I'm saying? Yeah, 35 is still pretty young. Yeah. Yep. And both of them have baggage. She has two. He got three. So they could have five. And and that's a good look. So, you know. And I'm just glad that they're looking among within the house, honey. They're all looking at each other. They're all African-American descent. So give everybody an opportunity, honey, to have, share the wealth. So that's what I like about and it. And the love. And it's the not love. just the money, Gary. Well, it's well, money, love also. Yeah, but love can't pay too many bills right now. Mm. <laughs> <laughs> I can't go to the electric company and say, oh, can I pay this $1,000 light bill? Love is going to pay it. So, uh-uh. But love sustains your happiness. Happiness, you know what that is? No. Okay. I'm <laughs> <laughs> Come on today, honey. Look like that. Come on today, y'all. It's Northern Droplet. On the high end, you say Northern Droplet. On the low end, you say beautiful metallic silver. That's your color for the day, honey. <laughs> All right, y'all. Give it up for Gary with the team. <laughs> <laughs>